Tariffs and trade wars don't seem to be having much of an impact on the port of Baltimore, at least not yet. Alex Dimitri reports the latest numbers for cargo are record breaking. It may not be manna from heaven, but cargo passing through the port of Baltimore is the next best thing. Infrastructure investments in deep water channels and huge cranes have opened the door to a new generation of supersized ships. It also handles more cars than any other port in the country. It all adds up. The latest numbers from March set new records for general cargo, over a million tons, as well as higher numbers for containers and vehicles. As a result, jobs have gone up over the last four years. Uh, um, from about 13,600 to over 15,300 direct jobs. And the number of jobs in the state of Maryland that are linked to the Port of Baltimore is now uh, just about 140,000. In wages and taxes, all that cargo coming and going generated over $6 billion in 2018. Different ports have different advantages. Baltimore's is all about location. We have a very unique location being the closest East Coast port to the Midwest. So that allows us to uh, handle cargo going to the Midwest uh, cheaper uh, to manufacturers and to uh, consumer bases and quicker. It makes sense to put the freight where the consumer is. So this is just the beginning for us. As more supersized ships move ever more cargo. Alex Dimitri, WJZ.